everybody doing on this gorgeous June 29th, Wednesday? Last Wednesday I was here, I did pretty good on the bluefish. Granted, every one of them was under one pound, but I still had fun. A good half dozen. What's up, man? How's everybody doing? Just a guy with a. Yeah, so today we're gonna go for some fluke. Have a simple high low rig, half ounce sinker. Three old bait holder hooks. Nice size jellyfish. Alright, let's do this. Hold up. Some more. Big jellies. Just need some peanut butter. Peanut bunker and jelly. Now that's just ridiculous. Tail is bit off the shrimp. I bet she it works again. If this the tail is bit off the shrimp, I'll still use it. It's still it's still good. Fluke don't freaking give a crap. Trust me. Oh, maybe they do. He went after the top. Smallest fluke I caught this year. Still hanging out there. No, he doesn't care. Try the shrimp three inch mullet on the bottom combo. Natural shrimp on the top. That's the Berkeley Gulp shrimp, the three inch. And that's the Berkeley Gulp swimming mullet, the three inch. That's in white. That's a natural color. And we got all these little bait fish swimming around here. Cool. I like to see that. It's been dead here and that's a sign of life. That plus whatever. It Keeps biting my uh, my gulp in half. Must be snappers or maybe even a puffer. Those guys down there are like, who the hell is this guy talking to, man? He just keeps yapping to himself. When it comes down to it, I think any gulp will work. Whether it's shrimp, the nemesis, the swimming mullet. 
I've had luck with every one of them. The pogey. I caught my biggest fluke over here with the pogey. 25 inch, right down there where you see those guys. They keep looking at me funny because I'm talking to myself. Well, they think I'm talking to myself. I'm talking to you guys. Damn, man, 600 plus subscribers too. Thank you very much. I am saying thank you again. That is cool, 600. So I'm gonna set a goal. By the end of the summer, or just by the end of the season, when I close out late November, early December, because I'm a wuss and I don't fish in the cold, my goal is a thousand by then. I would be more than happy, and if not, it's okay. Because I did not expect 600. I did not expect 100. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten people, mostly kids. They're all wearing life vests, so I guess that's cool. So what I do is I just all vigorously bounce it. This is my retrieve speed as I'm bouncing it. Very slow. Well, jigging it, bouncing it, same thing. And then I'll give a quick jerk, let it drop. Quick jerk, let it drop. Sometimes that's when they grab it. I'll feel the weight. Or you'll just feel the strike when you do that real fast. Oh yeah! You want to know something? They always feel big when you hook them. And that's the reason why. I foul hooked them. I thought this guy was humongous. That's why you heard me go, oh yeah! Ah, hold up, hold up. Let's get this. This way is this going? Yeah, I crushed the barb, so it comes right out. Here he goes. Now he feels really small. Here we go. 28 inches. What's up, what's up? How you doing, man? I caught one like, I don't know, 
I didn't even measure it, like 14 inches, maybe, if that. I thought it was a doormat because I foul hooked him, like right behind the eyes on the gill. I set that hook, my whole rod bent, and he started moving over. So, yeah, that's my only action for today. A couple of shorts, too, after that, but... That dude right there is pretty cool. Fluke Sharpie. I mean, when he is on, he will outfish you. Pretty good. Caught a, he caught a 25-inch fluke last year, too. I think I even have that on video. It's buried somewhere in my post. Be the last fish for today. Might be the last one for today. Once that sun goes down over those trees, I will go home. short but hey after a day of work I'll definitely take it 